In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to use simulation mode within Cisco Packet Tracer. So normally you use real time mode when you want to test out ping connectivity. So for example, you'd open up PC0 and you would run this command above and you would see the pings come in. But there is another method for doing this within Cisco Packet Tracer called the simulation mode. So down here in the bottom right, you have real time and you have simulation. I'm just going to close that real quick. So then you can click into simulation instead. And now we're working within a simulated environment. So for example, if I did open this back up again and I run a ping, it's going to sit here waiting because we're in simulation mode and we need to come over here. So this is that first little ping we sent. So the next step is it goes to the switch. It goes to the other switch. It comes down to the PC. And if you come in here, you see you still like haven't even done the first whole ping. It goes back up. It comes back across and it comes back down. So now if we open that window back up, we've got our first ping and a tick here. So that's one method that you can use for seeing simulation mode. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press delete down here and I'm going to start again and show you another method. So what you can do is you can actually send a simple PDU by clicking this little envelope up here. So I want to send it from PC0 to PC1 and I can press play and it will show me the steps it goes through. So it's come up to here. The next step is it goes over to this switch. It comes down here and then it's going to go back up. It's going to go across and back down again. Now it's kind of slow at present, but you can speed it up. It's going to come down here and we're going to see that tick. Now, the funny thing is if you let it keep going, it does this little weird thing. And what it's actually doing is if we drag it out, it's doing different little checks. So here it's doing an STP check. You can have ICMP. If the network doesn't know the ARP protocols or the MAC, um, which I'll show in a later tutorial, you'll also end up with those like ARP requests coming through in here as well. So this is a really handy way if you want to see how the different simulation mode works. And you can also like drag these all in together so you can see it once. But what we can also do is we can edit our filter. So we only have things that we want to see in here. So for example, we don't want to see the STP. So we can come into MISC and there it is. And now that'd be gone. So we'd only see our little ICMP peak. And what you can actually do is you can click on these and you can get these information of the OSI model where it's at. And then the inbound PDU, which is the data frame set up. So it's a really cool way that you can see, you got like a little challenge me here that you can try out and it will ask you questions as well. So it's really helpful if you're trying to learn different things. So this is how you can use simulation mode within Cisco Packet Tracer.